Lucas, thanks very much for joining us from Prague. Obviously, Spaceflow very focused on technology. What are you seeing at the moment in terms of the challenges in the sort of technology side in the real estate markets? So I would say like the, the biggest thing these days is still, you know, with, with that many people working remotely is actually how to attract uh, you know, the workforce and, and the people back to buildings, back to offices. I think this is the big topic for all the people working in the industry. And, and what we know that, you know, they won't come back before they will actually feel feel comfortable, right, about, about coming. And and uh, and before they will see the added value of office, because what we see now is that, you know, you really need to give people the reason why they should uh, go back to the office, to the building, uh, where where they used to work because they got used to you now working off remotely. So it's really important to make sure that we bring some solutions pretty quickly, and and that's exactly where we see tech can help. Uh, and it, it's maybe now we'll, let's elaborate more like which areas. So what we see landlord need technology these days is mainly to communicate or keep the relationship with tenants, getting really closer to them. Uh, Get, getting getting you know, this constant feedback and, and work with data because we believe that it's joint efforts of both landlords and tenants to actually redesign the whole office environment to, to suit the needs of, of the people, of the end users or customers uh, in every building globally. Uh, second thing is to, to ensure that we have you know safe and healthy environment. Uh, so that, that comes along with touchless endpoints such as, for example, easy entry of the building so you, you don't need any physical contact or card, you only use your phone to open turnstiles, uh, get into the elevator or, you know, open doors, things like occupancy uh, data, so you can easily rotate the workforce, uh, air quality data, also also super important topic. And lastly, in every crisis, there are many, many opportunities. So, so we look at it from the perspective, how you as a, as a landlord or, or space operator can operate your space, your building in, in like in a new model, where it's like a hybrid way of working or, or it's a space as a service. Uh, so here it's really also important to think, you know, out of the box, uh, how to implement features like for uh, hot test booking or, you know, access to various amenities to really attract tenants uh, back to the building and, and use the space, not just for working from the desk, but really bring all these other perks and, and, uh, and you know, um, well-being uh, or hospitality area, which is also super important. Really interesting to hear about some of those practical measures that, that landlords can be taking to try and build that confidence as people come back to the office. Um, thanks very much for joining us, Lucas. Thank you, Richard.